Hey guys, this isn't a lesson video, but this is a shout out video to some amazing students who have been doing their ST Math GG Penguin lessons. We have leveled up as a class almost 15%. Uh, I have our postcards. Sorry guys, I'm trying to stay in front of the light. I need to put a curtain up. I have our penguin posters from Gigi. Let's see, there we go. I'll put this in front of the window. I have our Gigi posters. We reached 10% when he was in Norway. And we reached our 20% on ST Math when he went to Ireland and the United Kingdom. But we have two more we got to add to our postcard board from Gigi. And that's 30% from our own very New Mexico Carlsbad Caverns. Gigi's postcard says, Carlbag Caverns are famous for the thousands of bats that leave each evening and return every morning. In fact, it was by following the bats that the caves were first discovered over a hundred years ago. When I visit one early morning, I watch them dive from thousands of feet in the air and then flap their wings like crazy to reach their roosts in the cave. What an amazing experience. As a penguin who enjoys the occasional balloon ride, when I heard parts of the caves were explored using balloons, I had to check it out. Scientists tied balloons to a camera so it would float up to the hard-to-reach sections. They even named one of the rooms they discovered the balloon ballroom. Now that some creative problem solving, how have you been a creative problem solver playing ST Math? I know a lot of you problem solve with your ST Math lessons. You're being just like Gigi. I've uploaded a clip to... Um, a video that explains Carlsbad's caverns because I've never been there. I, I know I've lived here for almost two years now. I've never been and some of you may not have been so I found a very cool interesting video that shows the inside of the caves. So I'll link that with this post. So that was 30% we reached as a class. We also, Gigi also sent me the 40% postcard because we were at as a whole class 41% completed of ST math and reaching our goal. This postcard says he's traveled to Arizona at Monument Valley. Gigi says if the tall stones of Monument Valley look familiar to you, it's probably from seeing them in the movies. Everything from old cowboy movies to the latest Jumanji have been filmed on this part of the Navajo Nation Reservation near Arizona and Utah. The dramatic sandstone monuments and beautiful desert colors make for a really cool movie scene. The deep red color of most of the rock formations come from iron oxide, which is similar to rust you might see on old cars or metal bridges. You might also notice that the buttes have three distinct layers, shale on the bottom, sandstone in the middle, and a special kind of sandstone called Myungkompi formation on the top. Don't you think some of the buttes look like the cones in ST Math? I can see that. It makes me feel right at home. Doesn't Gigi look so happy? So I have our postcards. He sent them to me here at home so I can add them to our postcard board and I'll get those up. And then I just wanted to give a special shout out to Xavier. I have our chart with us, guys. Xavier moved up one level. He's in second place right now. Let me block that light. Uh, Malachi's in the lead. He moved up one level. Kaleo moved up a level. Lindsay, great job. You moved up two levels since we've been away from school. Josephine, you moved up one level. And Araya, you moved up a level. So, guys, I have all our GG stuff. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I will get my curtain up today, I promise. I have all our GG stuff at home. I'm keeping track. I get on every day to see how you guys are doing. Remember, if you get stuck on a level, have your parents message me on JoJo, and I can um, classroom Google Meet you, and we can go over what you need to do on that level and I can help you with that. I'm still here to assist you guys when you get stuck. I don't want you to get frustrated, but congratulations. This is a huge accomplishment for you guys. I'm very proud of how hard you're working at home and not letting this long distance get you down. So great job, guys. Give yourself a high five. Let's do a sparkler. All right, and I will talk to you guys later. Have a good afternoon.